In this video, we're going to show you how to move forward once your child has mastered the ideas presented in our previous videos. This picture shows a basic progression of how learning cause and effect using switches can be developed into choice making by scanning through options. The two blue frames at the top show what we've covered in our previous videos. This video will focus on the middle and bottom of this progression. Let's start with timing. The following clips show examples of activities where the child has to think about the timing of when to press the switch. Oh, MacDonald had a farm. And on that farm he had a cow. With moo moo here and a moo moo there. Its paws are too rough. That's not my squirrel. Its cheeks are too smooth. Next, we need to think about timing and position. The child will need to track a moving object and press the switch when it gets to a specific position. You can adjust the speed at which the object moves according to your child's ability. In this game, the girl is trying to press the switch when the clown is in the middle of the circle. If she presses at the right time, he gets a pie thrown at him. If she presses it at the wrong time, nothing happens. The same idea applies to the next game where she needs to time the penguin's jump according to what else is happening on the screen. Now we begin to teach scanning. Scanning refers to choosing the correct object out of several choices. We begin with nothing here activities. This means that the child gets a reward for choosing the correct object and they don't get the reward when they choose the wrong object. This one? Keep going. This one? Keep going. This one? That's it. Nothing here, nothing here, a racing car. The next stage is sequencing. Just like the previous stage, the child will scan between choices. At first, there are no wrong answers. But as the child continues to make selections, spaces will clear up to form a nothing here spot. This one? That's it. The horse goes into the farm. This one? Next one. This one? That's it. The goat goes into the farm. This one? Next one. This one? Next one. This one? That's it. The chicken goes into the farm. Now all the animals are in the farm. Finally, we get to find the right one. This is formal scanning. The child uses one or two switches to scan through different options and select their desired choice. In this first clip, you can see the girl using two switches to scan. One switch scans through the options and the second switch makes a selection. In this final clip, you can see a single switch being used to scan a high-tech speech generating device. The scanning function has been set to automatic I like. timer. The buttons will light up one by one and the switch is used to make a selection. This can also be done with two switches, one scanning and one selecting. I like ice cream. <laughs> 